Hi, this is Dan from Zyler Insurance with our Two Minute Insurance Insight. This session we're going to talk about jewelry and fur coverage on a standard home, homeowner policy. These are the property subparts of a homeowner policy. In this topic, we're going to talk about the special limits for jewelry and furs. Interesting that they call it special when they're actually just limitations. Here's a list of the types of property that have sublimits built into the policy. There's a few reasons for having these special limits. One is that some coverage may be more appropriately covered on a separate policy. For example, business property or watercraft. A second reason is that what one person may own may be completely different from what another person owns. It really wouldn't make much sense for the policy to offer coverage and have us pay for $50,000 of jewelry when many of us don't own that much. Third would be that it just might be uninsurable. An example here might be money. Uh, it would be a little hard to verify how much cash one had after a fire loss. Now looking at the jewelry and fur limitation, you'll see that the limitation only applies for loss by theft. Coverage would apply without limitation to other perils like fire or windstorm. An important point to remember is that you won't find any coverage in the policy for just losing something, which is commonly referred to in the insurance world as mysterious disappearance. And this would apply to jewelry. Now when you either want to expand the coverage or increase the limits of jewelry and furs, you have two options. One is just to endorse your existing policy and two buy what's called a, a valuable items floater. That'd be a separate policy aside from your your home policy. You can expect to pay between ten and fifteen dollars per thousand for jewelry and five dollars per thousand for furs. The benefits of an endorsement or a separate policy one obviously you're getting higher limits and two uh, most of these forms are written without a deductible. Most importantly, I feel, is you're building back what's called uh, mysterious disappearance. So if you just lose that ring on the beach, coverage would be provided. Thanks. Again, this is Dan Zeiler. Feel free to contact me with any questions or concerns.